Phoenix is coming over tonight, so with the, the box in the living room and the wall being torn apart, I, I'm kind of in, my house is kind of in disarray, so I need to get that taken care of. No jobs on the books today, that's not good, but, but we woke up this morning, so that's great. See you on the other side of the intro. Not the other side, other side. Wow, I went away and I came back home and I have another package. Wow. And yeah, and this is a mess that I have to clean up. So here we go. We've got a package there. Um, freaking awesome. I'm going to open this later. The last of the snow right there. It's a snake snow. It looks like a snake in the ground. Here's one thing that Troy's doing today. I'm going to the scrapyard. Trying to get a little cash so that Phoenix and I can go to a special place tonight. It's going to be awesome. I think that he's going to really enjoy it, and I think I'm going to do it tonight. Here's something you don't know. In the truck, this stereo right here is a piece of garbage. Every time you hit a button on it, it does something else. I was going to take uh, the stereo from the, the Bronco and put it in here. Um, but of course, you know, since it's my daily driver, I'd rather have that premium sound in the, the Escape. There's one CD in this truck, and it just so happens to be this one. Here's the thing, we started our friends. It was cool, we saw pretend. Yeah, yeah, since you've been gone. I've never been a super fan of like comic book characters, Superman, Batman, superheroes, stuff like that. Um, and I don't know why I was like talking so much about Batman. It was just weird to see somebody in costume. Well, I just passed McDonald's and on the reader board, they said, Batman here, Sunday, 12 to two. So apparently Batman is on like a McDonald's world tour. How awesome is that? All right, a little birdie told me that we had something at the PO box also today. Today's like a day of getting stuff. So we're gonna go and take a look at that. And I need to hurry. I need to hurry because time is running out. And I don't care what the song says, time is not on your side. So you have to be on time's side. Make the most of every minute. Make it count. We got it. There was a long wait. There was a long line. Um, it is starting to rain very heavily right now. Troy's wet. <laughs> it happens. And let's see, where are we at? Oh yeah, we need some gas. She's a thirsty girl. Good news, I did get enough today so that we can go to uh, Chuck E. Cheese tonight. That's where we're going. We're going to Chuck E. Cheese. I think you'll have a good time. Of course, that's a plan. You never plan to have a bad time. It's like, hey, let's go out and do this. You know, hopefully we'll have a bad time. It is time. <laughs> I almost felt like saying, it's showtime, but I didn't do that. Um, Box, Christmas tree, where is it at? Oh, look at that. It's a nice, well, pretty nice rectangular box again. We are now off to get the boy. Everything's put away. Place looks pretty good if I don't say so myself, which I just did, so I did say so myself. So I'm saying so myself. As I leave, it just occurred to me, it's still sunny outside. It's currently 4.38 p.m. That means the days are getting longer. Awesome. No, I mean, it doesn't mean the days are getting longer. There's more sunlight. There's more sunlight to get more stuff done. And because that's what we are, we're little worker ants. That's what we do as human beings. We, we get stuff done. A bunch of people have like blocked my way when I'm trying to get, you know, through an aisle. And of course, you know, you say, you know, excuse me. I can see you. Can you see me? I don't hold the camera. All I see is this big blurry hey, thing right here. Hey, let me see it. <laughs> nope. So I was thinking. Can I got my brain. For some reason, I started talking in, and I'm going to say a British accent loosely because there's many dialects. So I was wondering if, if you were to have like a British accent and people would be oh. more... <laughs> If, if people would be more accommodating, polite, more polite. What do you think? If you said, excuse me, do you think that they'd be more polite than they would be if you didn't? I think two of the hardest things to find in the store ever is Velveeta cheese. Not the shells and cheese. This They're just teasing us right here. They're teasing us because we're looking for Velveeta, the actual cheese. Minions! Minions! He found minions, but the other thing is uh, Parmesan cheese. That's the other hard thing that's always hard to find. But we can't find the Velveeta. It's the elusive Velveeta cheese. So we have crackers, we have Triscuits, we have saltine crackers, and then we have cheese. This makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. I have found the elusive Velveeta cheese. You look in our cart, see what we have? 
We were like feet from it. It was like right there. Tack and Cheese! What? We're going to Chuck E. Cheese! We're going to Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah! All right. Wow, we have an awesome sky. The moon's up there. It's nice and creepy. We are at Chuck E. Cheese, and Phoenix is here. Are you excited? Yeah. I'm going to be yeah. totally yeah. politically yeah. incorrect yeah. and say yeah. that it looks like it's a, it's an Asian Chuck E. Cheese restaurant. It's only Chuck E. Cheese. So we got our pizza. Chuck E. Cheese coming out! <laughs> and Chuck E. Cheese is apparently coming out in five minutes. That is one cheesy mouse. I haven't been videoing the video. There's a, a, whoa. Go Phoenix, go. Good job, buddy. Woo, look at you. Oh, oh, you got two tickets. All right. Thank you. That's like whack a, what is, what is this? Whack a hammerhead. Okay, get him, get him. You gotta hit him when they pop up. Like that, like that, like that. Get him, get him. Uh oh, <laughs> uh oh, get him. Get him. Get him. No, use that, you gotta use that. I'm just trying to help you. <laughs> get him. Oh, that's it, that's it. We got nine points, which apparently is two tickets. And they just said, you are an excellent driver. Wait a second, this isn't right. You hit this pedal and the ride stops. The brake is on the wrong side. So this one's called Jet Rider. I don't know exactly. So the chair moves around, it vibrates, and then you can look up here at his face. I know you guys can't see it, but I can see it. <laughs> and he's like, wow. Apparently I just won the jackpot. <laughs> wow, that was awesome. All right, here, I'm gonna have you try it again, okay? All right, you try it again. Whoa, you did pretty good. This is Ducky Splash. The point is to get the ducks, <laughs> to get the ducks through the bridge or through the entrance. Are you ready? All right, here we go. Look at this technology. Look at that. Look at that. Woo, let's go. Get the duckies through the bridge. Get the duckies through the bridge. Well, through the tunnel. I'm sorry, it's a tunnel. Hey, you spray your ducks. Get away from my ducks. Get away from my ducks. Hey, hey, get my ducks. Oh, here, here, oh, there. <laughs> oh, no, no. Come on, duckies, come out, come out. There we go. There we go. Oh. <laughs> here, you have to make them go through the tunnel. Go through the tunnel. There you go. Make them go through the tunnel. There you go. Yeah. Good job. Look at this. This is all him. But you don't get any points for doing it on my side. So this is the automated um, put your tickets in here. Take a ticket. Feed it. So far he's got the badge. He did not go for the bat, or the spider, or the spider web, or the fangs, or the gecko, dinosaur, or all lizards. That was a lot of fun. Phoenix had fun. He's like, uh-huh, but we can't hear his head rattle. And uh, Phoenix's friend was there. So that was really yeah. cool. <laughs> so that was really, really awesome for him to be able to, uh, to have a friend there too. That was so cool. Although he's not in the stage right now, like, you know, oh, dad's not cool. Right now, dad's cool, so. No, he's not. 
<laughs> what? Yeah, what? This is the stuff that we got. So he got a lizard. I got this. Yep, that's, those are two sheriff's badges. Both of them are colored what? To green. Green. He's this. eating a cupcake because he ate all of his dinner. And glow in the dark fangs. Oh, yeah. Primarily because he couldn't make up his mind. I'm like, give the thing, the fangs. So that was my choice. <laughs> You want me to take a picture of the lid for your milk? Why? What 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 vlogging significance does a lid for your milk have? What? <laughs> You're such a goofball. Goofball. Yeah. It's the weekend, so Phoenix is sleeping, so I need to make sure that I'm quiet. So we're going to touch on a few COC comments tonight. Uh, the first comment of the night, Kathy LeBeau. Wow, you were first. That's awesome. Congratulations. Tweety fashion dancer. It's so weird to hear my own voice. The last time I had heard my own voice on recording, I was going into 10th grade. Wow. Yeah, it's weird because usually how you sound on recording is how you sound to everybody else in the world. Pretty close. Pretty close. Jolson, you need to put some dead cat fur on the microphone with hot glue. <laughs> yeah, that'd be a good wind protector, wouldn't it? Joseph Blau, first Thursday in April is National Burrito Day. See, I knew it. Carrie Ann Olson, why is there a stoplight there on the road leading to the highway? Well, it's the on-ramp and it's called uh, metered. So instead of a bunch of cars going onto the freeway at the same time, in theory, they space them out so it doesn't slow down, but it doesn't work <laughs> that well in my opinion. Emerald Gypsy Heart, sigh. Would have been nice to read the Facebook page. It would have been nice for me to read. I don't understand. Wolf Spain Hollow, Pat. Hi, it's so good to hear from you. Um, you say the uh, canopic jars will wear with time and were meant to look old, so any wear and tear, short of melting down, is cool. I know you take care of stuff. Just glad you enjoy them. I know they are so awesome. Um, I have more appreciation for them now than I, I than I did before. It, it's like they are really cool, and I'm I'm really thankful that you did those. Those were really neat. And the final comment of the night, Adam S. What is West Coast Haunters? Is it like a haunt expo? Um, it's a haunt convention, so there's lots of classes there for like home haunters and like makeup classes and make and take classes and a trade show floor that has vendors there's also a haunt opportunity that you can go to um, there's also a costume ball and a haunt auction so it's it's really cool the most important thing about it though is the camaraderie you have with other haunters it's like family it is so cool anyway guys happy haunting what's we'll oh wait hold on there's one spam and i can't pull these out of spam oh greta boss I drove home in a snowstorm. Come and visit me. I'm closer to you than... Oh, oh okay. I'm not... That's all I'm going to say about that. Okay. Happy haunting, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. As the keeper of the gate, I don't always have time to relax. But when I do, I always enjoy a good cup with the mouth of hell. Stay spooky, my friend.